Hi, I just wanted to share something that keeps coming up for me a lot when I'm coaching people. So are you in the world of surviving your life or are you in the world of designing your life? So a lot of us have gone through life just on automatic pilot. And unless we slow down and start kind of like prioritizing, slowing down and looking a bit deeper, we just get so caught up going through the motions of home work, children, paying bills, and it's like there's no real end to that. But as you, are we looking at the quality of our life, the quality of our relationships, our quality of our health? But are we really slowing down and, and paying attention? So one of the things I get is if we start slowing down and prioritizing, and, and like, are we nurturing the relationships? Are we using our time wisely? Are we are we like is our relationships kind of average or are they actually amazing? Like. Are we working towards improving things or, or just tolerating things? So we need to kind of slow down a little bit and actually start assessing what is it you really, really want and what is it you've actually got and can you take it to the next level? But so the key is we've got a lot of time in our hands, but are we actually using it wisely to design our future, design our success in the areas that's important or are we just going to go through life tolerating the way it is and it's nothing wrong the way it is but if you want more or better or you want to like, to have a more fulfilling life then the only way you can do that is by design because it, it won't happen by default we just get so busy with life that we'll just get swept along with the the, the with life and, and before you know it you've lost five years 10 years 20 years 30 years and you wake up one day and go what's this all about i don't even feel fulfilled so it doesn't have to be that way we just need to interrupt the pattern and start. Now, one of my mentors told me that if we ask ourselves quality questions, we get quality answers. And a lot of times we're, we're not, it's how we're talking to ourselves behind our eyeballs is determined what way we think. So we have to slow down and go, well, what can I do different? Is this really what I want? And start asking really good questions. Just say, all right, what can I do different to, to achieve a different goal? Most of us just go through life just repeating the same programming and then we end up not getting what we want. We get what we fear or we get what we tolerate. So I hope that makes a difference and I'll, I'll see you in the next video.